How you doing? My name is Mike Ulrich. I'm here today with Marine Max Venice, and today I'm going to be giving you a video walkthrough of the Boston Whaler 2023 350 Realm. Let's go. Starting off on the transom of the boat, this one is going to be offered with triplets. This is three 300 Mercury's in the cold fusion white. This is their new cowlings. It's got that nice sporty, edgy look to it. Across the transom, you're going to have three rod holders, standard located in the back. Right in front of that, you're gonna have that patented Boston Whaler bench seat. It is huge. Extra wide, comfortably sit three people there. You need to get it out of the way, pick it up, push it back, back to fishing. Over on the rear port side, you do have your standard live well located right there. Perfect to throw some bait in. Coming around right below that, you're going to have your tie through here. Nice wide cleat, raw water hookup, and this cool little swivel right here. What that is for is going to give you that extra handle. You got that dive door, that tuna door open. You can have that extra easy boarding on and off the boat. Coming forward into the boat, right in the center, you're going to have this awesome bench seat. So what's getting more and more popular in the larger center consoles is going to be that extra rows of seating. So this, you can have it facing forward or facing aft. When it's facing back, it's nice because you can be sitting back here. You can look out, have a nice view if you're doing trolling or anything like that. This boat is very unique in the Boston Whaler lineup as it's set up more for entertainment in some ways. Right here, you've got access to put food, drinks into an easy cooler. But a nice thing that Boston Whaler did is they thought of how easy it would be to load it. Inside opens up, easy access to your cooler. You do have dividers in there, so if you want to have your sandwiches and stuff up here that you don't want getting wet, you can do that. You can still fill it with ice and have your drinks located below. Coming over to the side, you're gonna have a little bit of a prep area. This is my coolest and favorite feature on this boat, is how they've concealed the grill in this. Most of the time when you have a grill compartment, the lid opens up, you lose that storage space, you lose that prep station. Right here on Whaler, you pull this, it spins to the side. You don't lose the Corian countertops. You can still use it as a cutting board. Plus you now have easy access to your grill. I think it is one of the coolest features offered on this boat. Moving forward to the cockpit, like I mentioned before, the seating configuration in this. Simply push this back right here. You're gonna have your nice seating facing forward. This middle seat also swivels 180. You can flip it around, turning it into a little dinette area right here. Table does deploy in the middle, so you can have yourself a nice conversation, a nice meal, and all be under shade while you do it. Take a look at the helm up here. You're gonna have your nice twin 16 Raymarine screens. Your rocker switch is located and labeled clearly, right, nice above, easy for you. There is a nice deep dish in here, which is perfect for throwing your phone, wallet, keys. You're gonna have your USB hookup in there as well, but 12 volt accessory as well. Going on down here, you're gonna have your throttles, new DTS from Mercury, and then right here, you're going to have your Skyhook joystick. The Skyhook is an awesome feature. This one also integrated with that is the autopilot feature. Going over the electronics on this boat, as you can see, it has a heavy, nice, large enclosure. That windshield, all unobstructed, one piece of glass with the actuated vent on the top. Above, you do have a lockable glove box, which is nice and deep to put more, you know, put more stuff up in there. You have a little divider in there if you want to have something separate so it doesn't rattle around. You're going to have a Mercury vessel view located right up top to take care of all your diagnostics and gauges, your Ray Marine for your VHF. But the biggest and most popular feature on this boat is the Sea Keeper. That's right, this boat is equipped with the Sea Keeper on it, um, so it is going to be ready to roll, perfect, prepared for all conditions. Cool feature that Boston Whaler has that not a lot of people notice or point out is this seat's actually electronic. So instead of having the old, you know, the lever like this that it uses to spin 360, a little press of a button here and there, it's gonna take your seat forward and aft to be closer and more comfortable while you drive. For our height impaired drivers, <laughs> Whaler gives you a cool feature of this little drop down platform right here. It's got some nice cushioned sea deck on there. If you wanna stand up while you're driving, be a little bit taller, have a better view, you can. Another cool thing that they have is you'll notice that there's a couple different notches right here. So whoever's driving this boat, whether regardless of your height, you can be comfortable and have a comfortable seating, you know, position while you're in control of the boat. So this boat is a center console, but with it being the realm, I like to say that you're in kind of a whole different realm of boating. So you do have a full cabin on this boat. Below, like I said, this boat is brand new. It's still available in inventory, which means it's still in the process of being rigged right now. Those big poles that you see located down there are the outriggers. That's right. This boat is equipped with outriggers. So it's going to be perfect for those long haul trolling. 
located down there you do have a nice sofa sleeping setup area you got a tv perfect for entertainment it does have full air conditioning so you can be down there comfortable at all times and also is going to have a full wet head located over to the side let's take it to the bow Nice side walkthrough, high sides, easy, nice and safe. It's not shallow, it is right at your hip and the bolsters that wrap all the way around the boat so it's nice and comfortable. So where this goes is gonna be right here in the front. This is going to be your front cushion that goes right there. The table is removable, but there is a cushion that is on this table. So it will drop down, turn the whole front into the sun bed. Right here, you got the triple wide seating with the built-in armrest and the cup holders that drop down. This is my wife's favorite feature on the boat. Of course, not that we own this boat personally, but I wouldn't mind if I did. Located up in the front on the side there, you're going to have the nice two stainless steel cup holders, but this one does have the JL audio package with it. You also have your remote control up there. So while you're sitting up here in the bow, enjoying your day in the water, you can turn the music up, change the songs, all by sitting comfortable without having to go back to the helm to do it. Alrighty. Concealed up in the front of this boat, underneath this nice hatch is going to be your windlass. You're gonna have your additional remote control located up here as always. You do have more controls at the helm, but you've got the remote here, the manual handle, even have a freshwater wash down concealed all within under the deck here. So you can wash that anchor off and keep it clean as you bring it back into your boat. So that's it. That is my quick video walkthrough of the Boston Whaler 350 Realm. For more questions, you can find me located here at Marine Max Venice, where this boat is also located on property and available right now. Again, I'm Mike Ulrich. Thanks for watching.